what I hear, that rogue sent up a retire is pretty intense. My daddy says your father's dad. Busy day for you, isn't it? Well, it's about to get busier. You're going to lead this operation, I'm told. Absolutely. All right, let's go over the details. Recent events have upset our timetable. Getting the reactor online has become our number one priority, and we're going to have to cut some corners. I'm not thrilled, but it means we'll need to rely on some pre-war tech. You're going to the mass fusion building to acquire a beryllium agitator for us. Consider it done. I'll consider it done when I've got it in my hands. I'm going with you. Sounds good. I'd appreciate the company. Not as much as I'd appreciate coming back in one piece. I don't like going above ground unless there's no other option. But here we are, with our options dwindling quickly. Not to put more pressure on you, but we have to move quickly on this. Word is that the Brotherhood is nosing around the area. We don't want them getting the agitator before we do. Head on up to the relay, and I'll meet you there. Dr. Fillmore. This wasn't really what I planned on doing today.
to get the power back on.
I'd love to get out of here before my hair starts falling.
A lot of us will have a hard time accepting an outsider as our next director. It won't be easy. Dr. Fillmore. I think that was enough excitement for, well, ever. Thank you, really. I'll make sure the act... I understand Father is anxious to get you involved in something else. You'd better not keep him waiting. Wanted to see me? No more than I'd expect from a man of my age. I understand mass fusion was a success. Uh huh. The job is done. That's what matters. For the moment, yes. The Brotherhood's intervention, uh -huh. future conflict. It also cannot go unnoticed that there were. I, of course, never doubted your commitment to our cause. But by directly confronting the brother, I'm proud of you. Regardless, the Brotherhood is an issue. Sure. And look at me. I'm wasting time. Mm hmm. Oh, good. Here I was afraid I'd have nothing to do. Very funny. There's some... This situation, I'm afraid... Is... Right. If I've done something to jeopardize the Institute... I have no doubt that you... While you were assisting Dr. Phil, apparently... The... My understanding is... I need you to go there and speak to your Minutemen gathered outside. Insist... Dr. Thompson, uh -huh. I know you can resolve this situation. They'll listen to me. Believe me. What's going on here? You're an unexpected surprise. We could use the backup. These Institute bastards aren't getting away. We don't know quite what we're doing. I'm not sure you know what's going on. Oh, I know exactly what's going on. Well, not today. So, but then we realize that makes sense, right? No one is going to do anything. Tell your men to stand down. I don't... Are you kidding me? If we don't do something, mm -hmm. are you going to order the... This whole thing is just a... Mis a misunderstanding. Mm-hmm. The Institute wants the same things you do. I don't know about that, but I'll make sure no one makes a move. Hey, Doc. Oh, thank God you're here. I was starting to worry we might not make it out of this mess. Everything's taken care of. You're safe. Good. Good. It was bad enough that Wallace started giving us trouble. But then he called in those sap. Those savages had you pretty well cornered. Did I not mention the part where we didn't expect this? This was supposed to be a simple extraction. Can we just get on with this, please? I know he's potential. If he's really... <sighs> You're right. I know they've been keeping... It, but once they real... I think they even... Let's just get wall. No argument from me. Let's go. Right. There's just... I was thinking. No problem. I'm sure I can... I hope so. No use. Mr. Wallace, I'm here to talk to you. You're another one of, uh, of them, aren't you? Are you a robot? Please, try and relax. I know this is an unusual situation. No! You're here to kidnap me! I've heard all the stories. Right. Hey, just calm down, okay? Fine, fine. The Institute needs your help. My help? The Institute has an engineering problem that your scientific expertise could help solve. In exchange for helping us out, you'd be granted access to the most advanced research facility imaginable. Whatever research you wanted to perform, anything, it's possible there. I promise. You'd be safe and secure. 
you'd be helping us create a better world. That... that sounds good. Okay, fine. I'll go. You must be pretty excited being named the next director. Ah, <sighs> okay. I think we've got this under control now. Thanks, Brett. You're gonna bring him in immediately, right? Oh, yeah. I'll see you back in the... Cannot express how pleased I am. Our new guest is familiarizing himself with his uh -huh. with his help. Phase three will be ready. I'm proud to help the institute. Here's hoping it all pays off. At this point, there is no doubt. It will succeed, and very shortly. There is one more part for you to play. It is time to announce. Right, because no one up there suspects the institute exists. This is not a joke. There has been too much posturing by too many groups. The world needs to know that we are in power, and the, as the incoming director, it is you. We've prepared. Use the microphone. For years now, you have suspected that the Institute still exists. That we are among you. It is true. But it is not the whole truth. We're here. And we are. The future. Our superior today, ensuring that we have no desire daily lives. We simply insist to do so. Dire consequences. Rest easy. In safe hands. And that mankind will thrive. Well, that was... interesting. Now it's time to make... How would you feel about... I could use some fresh air. A quaint phrase. Though I'm afraid the air there is any... Mm -hmm. The radio station, mm -hmm. if we'd like... Before we... Uh -huh. I've been assured. Report back... didn't really, uh, work out, but that's fine. Okay, let's try this. Maybe this goes here? I think the radio sounds better these days. Uh, I'm not getting nearly as many good. Hi. Hey, you're the new guy, right? Yeah, I'm the new guy. Well, it's good to have you here. 
Names are. Let's see what you have. Everything ham. your distance keep calm I'm that's exactly what a human as the day I was born well you do all right let's see what you got here's what we got Enjoy your trip to the big city. It's done then? The transmitter has been modified. Everything is in place. It's ready to go when we are. Good. Once the reactor is online, we'll cut into their broadcast. I'll let you do the honors. This, my friends. And that is the moment we've all worked spots. for. All your the time has finally come to start our reactor. No longer will we be forced to compromise to survive? No Coming more will we... Live from City. I'm your host, Travis Lonely Minds. We worry City. about outpacing our resources. Travis My father Lonely and I couldn't be more proud of what Jordan you have helped us accomplish. Knocking. And we look forward to achieving even greater things in the future. The Institute is now truly mankind's best hope. Thank you. All of you. Son. It's almost hard to believe. After all those years of hard uh -huh. work. What... I did good work, didn't I? Yes. Yes, you did. There's more work to be done before the Institute's future. The Directorate has convened a meeting. Take good care of yourself.
so many projects. So. From what I hear, that rogue sent at Libertalia was a real menace. Just as you gave life to Father, I did, he I gave life to me. May I be the first to welcome you, sir. We're looking forward to working with you. I'm happy to be here, Dr. Fillmore. I hope I do the position justice. I'm sure you will. Right now, we're all here because it's finally time to stand up for ourselves. Let's not be dramatic, Justin. There's nothing dramatic about it. To bring you up to speed, with the reactor now on... I'm sure the reactor will improve everyone's life. Yes. The Directorate has... Let's not beat around the bush. The Directorate has agreed that the Brotherhood of Steel needs to be eliminated. As the incoming director... Uh -huh. So, where do you stand? I think the last thing the Institute needs now is to make things... I would love to see that big airship. Mm -hmm. The conflict is already upon us. We really don't have a choice. If we're to... Uh -huh. As Director, we'd like your input... Uh -huh. Synths are the Institute's greatest strength. Well said. Oh, mm -hmm. Thank you very much for your time, sir. That's all we have for... At last, we have power adequate to our needs. Apologies. I have an urgent message from Z-114. Your quarters have flooded, sir. There... I'll go right now. Time is of the essence. To avoid any un... My compliments on getting B-592 back to us, sir. Sounds like those raiders have lived the table. Quite a handful. This place really is remarkable. There you are. You've met with the director. I assume uh -huh. it was difficult for them. It's the only way we can ensure... I'm glad you agree. Sure. You know, Father, uh -huh. the depth of your involvement, uh -huh. the question is... They mean nothing. To I'll admit. Then I certainly... Because these... Small as they are, they must be... You don't have to worry. Thank you. It's unfortunate that it's come to this. But there's really no other way. So many projects. So Unit X-688 speaks highly of your combat What took our five so long to reach you? You must act now. The Brotherhood of Steel has discovered the location of the railroad. What happened? A friend who works in the SRB overheard something. She smuggled out a message. The Brotherhood knows of the railroad's lair. We can't learn anything more right now. Even delivering those few words put her in great peril. I'll warn them right away. Thank you. I was hoping for more time to organize. Once you secure the rail... Actually going to do this. I don't know how yet, but we're going to rescue. I need people. you in her room. I don't want to talk about Blackbird. 
Carrington is sure to give me an earful about it. Z1's rebellion is ready, but we have a crisis. The Brotherhood's on their way here. What? What are you talking about? That's not all. The Institute has ordered me to kill you. All of you. I guess they consider... Right. So really, the question... Mm -hmm. Of course I'm not gonna go through with it. So, how do I deal with it? There's gotta be something we can do. We'll deal with that later. We need to prepare for a Brotherhood assault. Quick, take this. Tom made it for you. Sounds like we're going to need it. Everyone else, mobilize. We got Brotherhood incoming. Demona. We're cut off. The catacombs are now our only way out. We got lucky so far. No one's died. Your warning saved us. Thank God for that. You and the others go help Glory. Win that fight, or we're all dead. What the hell's going on? None of them got past me. Damn, that stings. Listen, the railroad's always sitting on its hand. Ah! You're the best thing that's ever happened. Promise me you'll free them. All of them. Hold on. You'll make it through. We can patch this up. You're gonna be all right, Glory. Bullshit. <laughs> Isn't there... Isn't there supposed to be a light? Desdemona. You've killed the last of them, and you're still standing. I wish the same could be said for glory. No time for that, though. The Brotherhood underestimated us badly. Their next attack will be far, far worse. So we do the unexpected. We eliminate the Brotherhood as a threat now, and the key to that is destroying their flying fortress. Pretty. Fortunately, we've got a contingency plan for that. Tom? We're activating Operation Red Glare. What? But Red... Then Bullseye will get you. Sure. I'll just swing by the local Super Duper Mart and pick one up. Need milk, too? This isn't the time. The Brotherhood's occupied the Cambridge police station. And Tom, you're going with him. Me? In the field? No one else can fly the damn thing. This one's for glory. Move out.
Hey. Man, how do you live up here? There is a million ways we could be monitored right now. Relax, Tom. You'll be all right. Right. The whole breathing in and out, okay? The police station is crawling with Brotherhood guys. At least one in power armor. But as promised, they got a vertebrate on the roof. You really up for this? Let's go. Prepping that vertebrate for takeoff is gonna take me a few minutes. So first, we gotta clear the police station of hostiles. I can't believe I'm doing this. some wheels or, or wings or whatever this is here's the deal after flight prep from the inside the right tell me about my role in this your job is tricky then get the hell back to our vertebrae flight prep is going uh -huh. so if paladins mm -hmm. Hey there. First things first, I picked up some brotherhood goodies for you. Merry Christmas. More importantly, the...
right. Final briefing time. Glory would have wanted us to go in guns blazing, but I'm thinking finesse. Got you this. If you're wearing the latest in the Brotherhood's fall fashion line, it might help you to place those bombs and get back in one piece. Uh, and the Brotherhood's just gonna fall for that? The Brotherhood is nothing if not arrogant. They'd never dream in a million years that an ex-farmer and a scabber could fly one of their birds. So if we look, walk, and if worse comes to worse, talk like an asshole with a superiority complex, we'll be fine! So, hey, if, if it only buys you a little time, that's better than nothing! When we land, Tinker's gonna keep the vertebrate bird spooled for an immediate takeoff. My job is to be Tom's lookout and make sure any looky-loos keep walking. Tom, we're getting closer to the blimp. Can you fly just a little straighter? I'm thinking, but man, I'm trying. If you want to give it a whirl, I won't stop. No, 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 you're doing great, Tom. Just keep her a little more steady. Yeah, 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 I got you. This is Claymore, requesting clearance. Claymore, you're cleared for launch Bay 3. Deck officer is requesting an update on the police station. Uh, hostiles eliminated. Scimitar status. Confirm. Scimitar took some fire. Should be up and running in a few hours. We have a visual on you, Claymore. Your docking port's not open. Got some technical difficulties with the port thingy. Working on it. Huh? Yeah, yeah, but, but, but which button is it? Uh, there? Claymore, you're clear for approach. Maybe constantly trying to kill us, but Commonwealth never likes to us. Don't take too long in there. If anyone comes over here, I don't know if I can fool you. Got enough problems, boss. I got this out. What's up? This area is off limits. Military business only. How did it look out there? We've got a lot of work ahead of us, brother. You came in on Claymore, right? The radio chatter from the police station had the tower worried. What happened, anyway? The railroad launched some half-assed counterattack. What? The railroad? They attacked the police station? They mounted some sort of last-ditch assault. I think the railroad's gone. That's a relief. The bird flew support on the railroad assault, right? How'd they beat us? I didn't see anything. We dropped off our men. Yeah. Yeah, so you're that Victorian brother. Sure. Now's not a good time to keep me waiting. 
and Claymore is hours overdue. Wait, why isn't Knight Owens handling this debrief? We had some big problems at the police station. Owens, he didn't make it. One disaster after the next. If you had arrived when you were scheduled to, we could have handled the debrief right away. As is, I'll send someone for you when I can spare the time. Dismissed. I can't help but notice you're empty-handed. Please, tell me those technical documents may... Uh-huh. Unloading cargo is not my job. Maybe I'll send one of the squires then. Stop. This is a restricted section. You shouldn't be up here. I am a superior officer. I don't have to answer to the likes of you. As you say, sir. But when my shift ends... One down. One to go. Now to get out of here. Close to it. I believe we're actually here to hold it. 